Mr. Montgomery uh, is going to be, he's going to be talking to us. There's Mr. Montgomery, wait for Mr. Montgomery. Oh. This is Nancy and this is Enrique. They're our TV stars from Ferguson. Oh, wonderful. So they said we can't have autographs, though. No autographs. <laughs> okay, let's pay attention. Let's go. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Hello everybody, welcome to the ABC Hour. I'm Lon Brunk, Director of Information and Technology at the ABC Unified School District. Joining us tonight on the ABC Hour, the President of the ABC Unified School District Board of Education, Mr. David Montgomery. And, first, and it's always a great night because we're gonna have students on from Ferguson Elementary School. They call it FACT, a magnet program, Ferguson Academy for Communications and Technology. You're going to be, I think, uh, surprised, amazed, and well pleased that uh, what you're going to hear from them. And Here we go. Jason, prepare the film. Yeah. Here we go. Here it goes. Okay. Three, two, there? one, go. And welcome back to the ABC Hour. I'm Lon Brunt, the Director of Information and Technology at the ABC Unified School District. Joining us tonight, co-hosting on the ABC Hour, David Montgomery, the President of the ABC Board of Education. And uh, David, we had a great chance at the beginning of the show tonight. And talk about all of the schools. We mentioned a couple of our magnet schools. Yes, we One do. of them is about to join us right now from Ferguson Elementary School, and I know that as a member of the board, you've heard a lot about their program oh, over the last couple of years. I certainly have. Uh, I keep very up to date on what's happening yeah. in Ferguson. And it's a, it's a real pleasure to have the principal. And, uh, welcome to the ABC Hour, Linda Dome. Thanks for being with us tonight. Thank you for inviting me. And you've got some wonderful students. I think we're going to let you go ahead and introduce the students and talk a little bit about some of the folks, that, uh, what's going on in the background that folks can't see if they're watching at home. Absolutely, positively. With us this evening, filming for our own FACT TV, we have Berta Martinez and Maritza Reyes. They're being supervised and coached by our own technology resource teacher, our um, broadcast and recording studio teacher, Mr. Joe Bustillos, and also our magnet coordinator, Ms. Mrs. Diane Ramirez, is here with us this evening. And we have two wonderful students who are stepping up to the cameras tonight All right. to work with us, Nancy Hueso and Enrique Roa. Nancy and Enrique, both of you are involved in the FACT TV show. I'll go ahead and start with Nancy. And uh, the FACT TV show is a, is a program that the students at Ferguson produce in your own TV studio, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. What kind of experiences have you had well, uh, on the show? I've been in front of the camera, I'm reader one to the whole thing. Mm -hmm. I'm the anchor and uh, you, you kind of, sometimes you get nervous and you get stuck in some words, but I think that if we practice a little bit more, we can get it fluently and mm -hmm. be able to do it more better. Are you involved in writing the copy that you're reading as well? Yeah, some uh -huh. of them. So a lot of skills going on. I mean, if, if uh, me, I just come up here and talk. I don't do much. So I mean, but you actually have to write stuff and and you have to give actual facts out and everything. So that's kind of a nice skill to have to be able to write and read on the air at the same time. How about Enrique here? Um, um, I've been year three, year one, and year two. I've been. I sometimes edit videos that we have and, um, um, and I work the cameras and I tell people how to keep it like home and stuff. Mm -hmm. Probably for me the highlight has been this year when we had visitors from Taiwan coming to visit our school, educators from Taiwan who read about us in the Commonwealth magazine, which is distributed sure. widely in that area, they read about this school with technology and had to come and visit. Mm -hmm. And um, they met these students who serve as ambassadors as well. When we have guests on campus, they recognize Mrs. Griffo from a visit. And unfortunately, Mr. Bustillos was not there the day we were able to go into the broadcast and recording studio. But with all the work that he's done in preparing them in there and all the work Mrs. Ramirez has done working with teachers to prepare them in terms of their writing, their, their content, and organizing the curriculum, um, in spite of not having Mr. Bustillos there, we were able to have the students break out the cameras, set up, and show these educators from Taiwan mm -hmm. just what they were able to do Thanks. independently. It was awesome. So we don't need Mr. Bustillos. <laughs> <though. laughs> <laughs> I don't he's think any of us would go that far. And uh, have you seen a 
kind of the feeling of it all coming together from the staff and from the community now? Absolutely, mm -hmm. absolutely. I think staff, which was overwhelmed at first, has really um, been amazed with themselves at how much they've grown and how much our children are able to do. And I think parents are our just you know, staunchest mm -hmm. advocates because they see that their children are truly, truly capable of doing more than I think we envisioned that they could do. Mm -hmm. It's a great place to be and we invite all of you and, and our community down and, and those others in the community to come visit any time. Excellent. Wonderful. Thank you, Principal Linda Dome, Nancy, Enrique, and everybody at Ferguson Elementary School. That's a fact, and there you can see the future stars right there. In fact, uh, Ferguson Academy of Communication and Technology.